Hello, one and all. Welcome back to more Let's Play New all Pokemon right. Snap. I am the Max of You Trades. And off screen, I went back to the under water nice level job. and uh, I, I managed to finally get the picture of that plant that he wanted so very badly and I finally obtained the ultimate carp photo hot damn all right nice work. also got a one star credilly so there you go oh, that's also a diamond dang we're doing okay got a two star whalemer it's not gonna be a particularly good one but it doesn't need to be it still gave me silver okay as long as we're filling up the spaces as it turns out, the way to be able to get a clear shot is to throw an apple at the sleeping <laughs> the sleeping Pokemon to make it get up and leave. Uh, still don't feel particularly great about that, but there you go. I finally got the ding-dang thing that he was looking for, so we're good. And if you don't mind, I'll be taking my extra points with me. Thank you very much. All right. Also, I'm get okay, there you go. Oh, that's what I'm getting. All right, that's actually a pretty solid picture, not gonna lie. By the by, oh, you've got something to report? Yeah, I bet you do. Although I'm not entirely sure what exactly it is you're gonna be... I mean, I, I get it. You're gonna give me the orb to light up the plants, but it doesn't really seem to accomplish a whole heck of a lot. <laughs> Those only seem to really have a huge impact during the nighttime. I mean, I guess sometimes during the day, but mostly the nighttime, so it's a little, a little strange. You can certainly give it a try, but there you go. Yeah, I guess just take it to the beach or reef. Well, we will. We will at some point of that, I assure, but not here, not now. We've got far more important things to do. All right. First and foremost, oh boy, let's see. I believe I've been to every part of these now that we've got a, the whole two, the, 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 the level two situation. So that's good. We got that going. What we didn't do, though, is another go of the volcano now that it's at level two. So let's go ahead and check that out. Then we'll head on over to the new place. And whoa, my voice went wicked croaky there for a half sec. Woo. All right. I have been recording significantly more than I normally do, but I have chosen to do this regardless. I just won't go as absolutely crazy. Anyway, whoa, look at all those little ones. Look at all of them. Oh, a bunch of shinks. Hello. Very cute. Very cute. Hello, yes, it is I. Nice to see you. All right. Okay. All manner, manner of Altaria. Wait, what? That was a Talon Flame. All right, it's going to be a terrible photo of a Talon Flame, but I have photographic evidence. And that's what we really need in these crazy crazy uh, days of our lives. I'm not really sure what I'm going with, going for with that one. All right. Really shouldn't have zoomed in on that one. Should have just taken the shot when it flew by. Unfortunate. Whoa, that's a solid Monferno picture. Okay. Way better than the one that we had before. We take those. Whoa, and Graveler's aplenty, apparently. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Man, we got all sorts of stuff going on here. Oh, and what are we looking at here? What are we looking for? Whatever that is. What are we looking at here? You can hear some happy humming sounds. Yeah, I bet I can. But what does it mean? What are these creatures up to? Hello, yes. Yes, you're very scary. Your, your, your stats are actually fairly good. It's a shame that, you know, you have that whole defeatist ability thing. Seriously, if it has less than half of its HP, all of its stats get, like, halved. I'm not sure what the deal with that is. Whoa, okay. One of those has got to be a good shot. A star value that I don't already have. Is that really the noises those make? That's just crazy. That's way high, or higher pitched of a screech than I would have assumed. Anywho. Whoop. Oh. There we go. All right, we got a few of those going for us. I thought maybe that would have woken up the Tyrantrum. It didn't. I mean, I guess maybe, why would somebody want to wake up the gargantuan dinosaur Pokemon? Because I want a, a photo of it. That's why. Wake up, large butt, come on. Disgusting. Will this tune ever do anything for anybody? I swear. Also, is that magma straight up blue? The heck am I looking at over there? What's that all about? I 
Everything won't stop screeching over there. It's a symphony of very bizarre noises. And it's Charmander. What are you doing down there, Lado? Crimes? The you doing? Said he's picking up a weird reading from in there. Yeah, I bet you are. Who wouldn't be? Hang on. Hang on. I'm making an effort here. I don't know. Some part of me thought that maybe if I was able to make both of the Charmanders just kind of... Oh, that's definitely something. If I got both of those Charmanders to move, we would have we would have saw something there. Oh my goodness, what is it? Torkoal! I love Torkoal! Oh, really? That's so great! Bonk. Huh? <laughs> there you friggin' go. And what's that? Oh, it's nothing of note. Nothing of value. I guess I'm making everything all shiny. What the? Happy Slugma! A very happy slugma. All right. Uh, missing anything else around here? No, we're pretty good when it comes to Graveler photos. We don't need to worry about that. This has been a fascinating adventure. I don't think magma can be blue. So this is an interesting experience. One that I shall cherish for all days, but still straight. Woo, Typhlosion! Yo, lad! Over here! Nice. Pop yourself! Whoa! Alright, alright, alright. Oh, 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 oh. I see. I see. Alright, alright. I'm almost at the end of the course. Dang. Dang, dang, dang. I was hoping for a better photo of a Typhlosion, but eh, well, you know, any photo is better than no photo. Slugma! Chilling in the deep end. Oh, what a lad. What a lad. What the? Oh, hello. How are you? Also, what are we looking at here? And... There we go. Have some ancient ruin photos. Wow. You know, I don't think I've ever seen an Aerodactyl on its legs before. I'm seeing a lot of Pokemon do things and be in positions I've never seen before. I mean, sure, naturally it makes sense that an Aerodactyl could use its legs. It's just, I'm pretty sure there's never been a chance in any game to ever show that. Usually, most Pokemon just kind of stay in the one general position their entire existence. It's Fascinating stuff. Anywho, gotta be some good shots up in here, I think. Ooh, yes, yes there is. All right, no, we've already got that one settled. Uh, I, 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 I see, I see, I see. Hmm. These are pretty mediocre, if I'm being honest with you. I'd much rather have a really, really good one star. I can always get another one later. And atrocious, but you take what you can get, I suppose. Oh, I already have a three star? That's all, but this is such a good photo. Ah, <sighs> you never... Yeah, I'm never allowed to have what I want, man. I swear. All right, then fine. We'll go with that one. There we go. Get that fire shooting out. And that's an improvement. We've also got Slugma for days. Look at this slug. Look at that sluggy boy. Also fascinating. All right, then fine. Torticol. There you go. Aerodactyl. Yes. There we go. A rare photo of it on its legs. All right, that's probably the best we're going to get out of that. And also, I'm starting to get the impression I should have been... I, I should have been taking photos of ancient ruins this entire time, and there are probably levels that I could have done it, and I haven't, and it's going to eventually tell me to do so. So that's unfortunate. Regardless, behold, a Shinx. It's a little confused about what's going on. However, that's a hell of a lot of points. So, no major complaints. That is a bad photo, but it's a photo nonetheless. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I accept the fact that that is not a high ranking one. All right, however, this has got to be pretty good. Yeah, all centered in the frame and whatnot. It's not looking at me, but what it is doing is shooting the fire out of its neck. That's pretty cool. So, you know. Okay, gold, gold. We take it, we take it. 
Climate. Can't say that's not a huge improvement in every conceivable way. Okay, I wouldn't call it diamond tier, but sure, okay. Interesting they went with Monferno. Not a Chimchar, not an Infernape. Nah, nah, nah. You find Monferno. That's fascinating. So that's how it rolls. Alright, alright. Thank you, thank you. An Aerodactyl, most triumphantly perched down. Good on it, good on it. Nice work. Mediocre. Oh, it looks like it's on its way to do something. Probably looking for beans. That's what most things be doing. Torkoal! My lad. My lad, my lad, my lad. Uh, can we at least get a gold with that? We can! All right. Nice work. More sluggy boy. The sluggiest boy. Yeah! And it pops out of the uh, the, the whole, you know, the, the, the frame with all of the blue around it. It, it. it really, I don't know, that's just a really good composition for a photo, I think. I'm no expert at this stuff, but that seemed like a pretty good time. And check that mess! Mm -hmm. Dang, 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 son. Yep, blue magma! Ah. By the way, oh, you've got something to report to you. Okay, I admit. What? What, what, what is it? What, 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 what is it? What do you, I, I am curious. Oh yeah, I forgot to say. Dang, 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 dang. I discovered something. I'll, I'll, I'll show it later, though. <laughs> I could have showed it, or, uh, uh, you know, just a few seconds ago, but I missed my opportunity. It's not anything super important or that interesting. It's just neat. Also, oh, dang. Ah. She is shooketh. I can't believe there were ruins that deep inside. It must have been built by people, too, right? Mm -hmm. Right you are, and most likely with some special purpose in mind. Also. Perhaps some sort of ancient cult. God only knows. And as for that big hole we saw in the wall... We should probably go in that thing. I picked up an Illumina Pokemon's energy coming from inside. Where do you suppose the hole leads? I don't know, let's friggin' go! I wouldn't be surprised if it were a tunnel all the way to a far off volcano. You think there's a Pokemon that uses that tunnel to get around? What kind of Pokemon would do that? Hmm. We'll have to see for ourselves. Good luck on this next expedition. I see, I see. So we've got two choices basically then. Ah, two Illumnias, huh? Could you take another pass at the lentil seafloor for me? I'm seeing fascinating energy readings coming from there. Are you trying to tell me I have to go down to the damn seafloor again? What, was there, were there ruins down there that I didn't take photo of at any point? Are you serious right now with that? <sighs> uh, all right, you know what? Let's shake it up. Let's go to the Illumnia spot first. It makes sense there would be, you know, one in... Each island, you know. We had a Meganium. That was pretty freaking dope. What the heck are we gonna find here? Where's that reading coming from? I don't know. You're the professor. Hmm. I'm just what a guy with a camera. Right under you. Under me? Nani! Ooh. Oh, that's a fantastic candidate for this sort of thing. Follow that Milo tick. Doing it! Don't you even worry. Hello. Hello there, miss. You are one majestic critter, yes you are. Also, hang on. If it just surfaced, I'm sure you could use an Illumina Orb. If it, yeah, I'm sure I probably could. I'm also trying to see, what am I trying to scan here? I don't know what I'm trying to scan. It's like underneath me or something. That's weird. I should probably be keeping my eye on this the entire time. Could you please, uh, I don't know, breach a little bit? Ooh, ooh, sorry. Oh, I really did not mean to do that. Uh, yep, you sure are right under me, you sure are. Hmm, yeah, I don't think my scanning is going to be doing much of anything. Oh, wait! Hang on! Hang on! Hang on! Okay, okay, okay. Those aren't bad. Those aren't bad. I bet a fluffroot could reach it down there. Yeah, probably. I hit it in the head. I don't feel too particularly good about the fact that I bonked it on the head either, if I'm being honest with you. Huh? Ah, my throwing arm leaves a lot to be desired. I'm gonna be honest with you, Todd. <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you. 
Not making a lot of progress on that front. And Fluffroot! Fluffroot! Yeah! Ah. Bonky again, my bad. Then again, maybe the bonk is what made you, I don't know, reach out? It's hard to say. I certainly have no idea. That's the stuff. Okay, I feel like that definitely could have been a way better photo if it was facing me. Yep, okay. Very shiny, very shiny. Mm-hmm. I'd kind of like my best possible photo of Milotic to actually, you know, have its face in frame. If that's at all possible or doable. It's also crazy just seeing this thing swimming around. I like it. Always with the bonking. I'm throwing the orbs. Throwing the orbs. Oh, wow. Okay, that's significantly better. At least we got a side view of the creature instead of a back view. We take those. Man, I'm bad at throwing. Now, if you could just swim at me. Where'd you go? Oh, well. That was a missed opportunity. Oh. Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. Oh. I wasn't expecting it to make a, you know, a free willy leap over me or anything. That, that wasn't something I was ready for. Although it seems to be leaving now. I uh, don't, I don't, I don't think we're going to get another chance at a photo here. It is, it is really far away now. Just saying. Unless another one is about to pop up out of nowhere. Uh, I think, I think that's all, that's all she wrote. And I mean that in the most literal of terms. Looks like it's swimming away. Yeah, it's long gone. Well, I'm on back for now. All right, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I'm also just gonna hope that, uh, you know, one of the photos I took is actually pretty good. I don't know what star level that jump over the Neo 1 would have been. I mean, at the end of the day, I can only show off one of these photos at a time anyway, so. It's not that big of a, you know, of a frustration that I missed it. Anywho, anywho. Mm, let's see. Okay, so all of the photos of it underwater don't count. That's weird. I see. All right. All right. Well, then we're gonna have to go with this one. That's uh not great, honestly. But hey, eh, eh, it's the best we've got. It's the best one we got because apparently it being underwater means it's not any good at all. Excellent. It seems to be having itself a pretty good time. There you go. What fascinating behavior. Okay, hey, diamonds. Diamonds forever. We take those. And... And it's already gotten a level up. Fascinating. I never did check out the Meganium again after I got that level up, so now I'm left to wonder, what exactly does that end up doing? The pinnacle of beauty. Well, it sure do be a massive pain in the ass to evolve it, that's true. Anyway, you got something else to report, do you? Man, what, are, what, what are the odds of that, I wonder? Dang it, I could have showed that thing again. Damn it, it's when you're picking out photos. Why can't I not remember? It's something so stupid. <laughs> but I still want to do it. Just to say that I did. Ah! All right. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally cool. Everything is dandy. Yep. All right, there we go. Now we know for sure that Illuminia Pokemon live on this island as well, as if we had any even slight remote doubt of that at this point. I guess maybe you mean that one specifically, but like, still, dude. That brings us back to the idea that the events depicted in Lentil's Legends actually happened and aren't a bunch of hooey! I mean, a bold assumption on your part, but there you go. Don't the Legends say Pokemon warded off some huge disaster? 
What do you think it was? I don't know, probably gout. Evidence suggests it was a meteorite. Dang, does that mean we're gonna be seeing Rayquaza or something? That'd be dope. About 2,000 years ago, what we now know as the Chtelor meteorite arrived. And boy howdy, was it covered in all kinds of goo, apparently. According to the legends of what happened then, the Illumnia Pokemon's power was scattered all over the region, making the Pokemon of Lentil glow. An interesting idea, isn't it? I, I guess. What? But here's my theory. What really caused the Pokemon of Lentil to glow was in fact the Tello Meteorite itself. And Illumnia Pokemon are the ones that were most heavily affected by the Meteorite. Huh? So the legends are wrong? Mm -hmm. Yes! That's what we're trying to find out, which is why our research is so important. I see. Fair enough, I suppose. All right, then, you know what we could do? Apparently talk to Todd. Okay, fair enough. Hey, how you things going? Research all right? Yeah, they are. Listen, I know you can take the Neo One off to other islands, but why not snapping some photos here? You may already be familiar with the Pokemon around here, but I bet you'll find new sides to them if you look. By the way, just choose this icon at the top left of the research camp menu to get started. Appreciate it. I mean, there are several Pokemon that are running around these here parts that I don't have documentation of, so sure. I admit to being curious. Let's see, take photos here at the research camp? Yes, I will. For example, how long has a Meowth been here? All right, at least we always knew about the Stoutland. You gonna wake up, buddy? No, of course you're not. Wake up! <laughs> ah, sleepy ass cats. What just meowed at me? Is that Meowth again? Oh. Apparently. All right, fair enough. <laughs> All right. Oh, a Trubbish. Well, that's pretty great. I feel good about that. Yay! Hey! Look at me over here! Pseudo Wudo! All right. Interesting. Man, there are way more Pokemon around here than I realized. All right. I want a good shot of that there Trubbish. Because Trubbish deserves better than people give it. That's great! There you go. Also, Eevee! Over here, you nerd! Oh. Look right over here, you stinker. Oh, what's going on here? Uh, watering trough for Pokemon. Alright, well, I still got the photo. Can't say I didn't. And then off they go, apparently. Just leaving Trubbish alone? How rude. Pseudo Wudo! Over here, bro! Hey! Over here! Also, I think Pikachu's doing something. You know, good for it, I guess. Dang. Alright. I still yet to find a single use for this damn song, I swear. Oh. Hey! Hello there! All right, that'll have to do, that'll have to do. What about this fire pit over here? Anything? I'm frying up some apples. I'm frying them up. I'm frying them up, people. Nobody wants them? All right, fair enough, I guess. Uh, what's this? Oh, hello. You mind popping yourself out? Huh. All right, clearly not. It's a bundle bee, but it won't, it won't leave. Unless I was supposed to sink three shots at, at once there, that wasn't gonna happen anytime soon. Man, all right, well, could have been worse, I guess. Uh, oh yeah, whatever. Yeah, that was fun. I didn't realize we were doing that together. So that's, that's neat. All right then. Hello, why are you taking photos of my pets? All right. And let's see here. Uh, yeah, let's go with that one. I like that one. We'll also go with this. And you better believe we're gonna go with that. And uh, well, a picture of a pseudo-wudo is a picture of a pseudo-wudo. 
I just realized I, I, I honestly, I, I, I thought I already had a photo of an Eevee. Apparently, I did not. Go figure. All right, then. Check out all this official documentation, y'all. Let's do this. And look at this very perturbed me out. It is having a day. That's what it's doing. Great timing. And... Yo! All right. I'm proud that that's diamond level. And I think this Stoutland is looking rather majestic, all things considered, so... All right, well, apparently they disagree. Needed more of its body in the frame, no doubt. Oh, I swear. So picky, so picky, so picky. However, that's a good one. Hey, sure real good and right there. And that is absolute trash tier. A trash fire of a photo is what it is. 2,000 points my left foot, I'll tell you that. All right, Eevee didn't really seem to have any interest in turning around so I could actually, you know, get a good photo. So I'm just going to have to settle for that. Also, check it out. A Starly featuring Pikachu. So that's not, that's not nothing. Nah, picky, 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 picky. I couldn't make that thing any bigger than it already was, so... Yeah, all right. The size is already fairly impressive. Yeah, I was hoping for a diamond on that one. Sigh. Can you even level up this place? Is that a thing you can do? Apparently... Oh, well, mm -hmm. theoretically, maybe. Theoretically, that might be a thing that you can do. I do not know. I truly do not. All right, so before we head off to a completely brand new area, rather, uh, you know, with another Illumina. Wait, damn it, I couldn't, oh, I keep forgetting. Mm. Before we head over to the Volcano Illumina Pokemon, right. let's go back and check out that Meganium again. Now that it's a research level two, what exactly is different? They don't appear to be photos of Lentil, but it's clear they were, not, eh. Every time I keep trying to learn about Rita, the game is all like, ha ha, nope. Anyway, hello, you majestic creature. This is a hunch, but you might find something new. Like this Meganium chilling out with an Eevee. That's pretty cute. Like, look how happy it is just to be here. Majestic creature running along. Trying to bean an Eevee in the head. It's harder than it looks. All right, well, there you go. I got it. Uh, throwing. Throwing. Throwing again. Come on now. Go for it. One more time. There we go. Hey. Awesome. Really? I guess that was in the middle. There you go. Just keep on shining. Yeah, get that sniff sniff. Get that Sniff Sniff Styles. Ha, ah, yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. I mean, you have to go through each one of these at least four times to try and get a photo of all of the, the star ranks, so. One of these photos will be good, I'm sure. I, I desperately hope. <laughs> Let this have served some form of purpose. Does it just kind of follow along? Hard to get the whole thing in shut, you know. Not for lack of trying. Anything else going on around here? Oh, getting another little sniff sniff? Yeah, that's fair. Gotta sniff that good glow worm. That's what you gotta do. And I threw an apple at your butt. <laughs> and if only we could make that whole tree glow or something. All right, now it's getting itself a munch. And we're almost out of here. There's something there. There's something here? What's up? What, 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 this? What's this? Uh, oh, I see. Ancient ruins. Fair enough. But apparently there was something else I was supposed to 
analyze at some point. Oh. It's just the Pokemon itself. Gotcha. Fair enough. Hello, it is me and all of my majesty. What are you even gonna do about it? All right. And the Neo One is set to return. Let's leave this place. Ah, oh, man, it was just about to start doing skateboard tricks. Oh, no! Could you imagine? That'd be awesome. It's time. All right, get the hang of this course. Why don't you? All right, all right. Let's see here. I have a two star. Do we have anything? Mm -hmm. Nothing three star. So we're gonna have to settle for a one star. Great. Absolutely stupendous. All right, what's our best one star? Let's go with that one. Let's just go with that. And that's a three star, so we'll take that. And here, have some ancient ruins while we're, since we're here and everything, why not? I still didn't do the damn thing. I'm an idiot. Right. Ah! Okay, we've got like at least at least one or two more goes around before the end of the video. I can still do it, damn it! And yo! All right. Very good. Very good. Nice work. And what about that mess? Huh? Silver. All right, sure. And there, have some ancient ruins too. A new discovery. Yep. They're the most newish discovery to ever be new. Collect them all, why don't I? And give me a little bit more points. There's no way you can get 50. Nah, nah, nah. Mm -hmm. you... Why? I don't know why these things are the way they are. It's so confusing. Maybe I can do it here. Oh, you can't just do it here. Oh, all right then. Yeah. Uh, all of the Pokemon ha silhouettes can, like, move and bounce around when you, when you hover over them. I told you it wasn't anything all that important or impressive. It was just bothering me that I couldn't actually show it off. Because I, I discovered that, and I was like, oh, well, that's kind of neat. Maybe I should tell people about that in case they didn't know. It's possible they didn't know! So I feel good about saying it. I don't want to go back to the damn seafloor. I've been there a bajillion times already. Hmm. They're always asking me to do more stuff. I want to go, I, I wanna go take a photo of a, a very shiny Pokemon. All right? What Pokemon you figure is actually gonna be in the volcano and be all shiny shimmery? Mm, hello. Something magmatastic. Hmm. It couldn't possibly be in all that lava, could it? I mean, many Pokemon could. It's okay. Hi. Hi, Volcarona. Wow, it's a good thing this thing's got a shield or I'd be dead. Oh! Multitudes! Oh my! Jubal Corona! Hot damn! Here of Illumina Pokemon? Incredible! Weird, I Isn't Volcarona No, Volcarona's not a legendary. It can evolve. Generally a legendaries don't evolve. Generally. Generally. Okay. Uh Ah, okay, uh, apparently. Yep, those are some ancient ruins right there. Yeah, maybe. How do I do that? Throw apples? I'll just keep throwing fluff fruit at them. Maybe that. Maybe that's the ticket, because that's literally the only option I've got. I can also play a useless song. That's something I can do. All right. Well, at least I'll be leaving this place with. A photo. It would be nice if you were a little bit more glowy, if you know what I mean. All right, unless I get like a spray gun or something at some point, I don't really know how I'm supposed to put out all of these flames. It just keeps staring at me with malicious intent. Like, man, I don't mean you any harm. I'm not even trying to catch you. I just, I, I just want some photos. Get them published in some kind of magazine, you know? I don't... You don't gotta be all like that. Woo! They are a, a definitely a majestic pair of fire mobs. That's what these are. Yep. And I'm just kind of left to ponder if there is anything I can do about this. Really does not seem like it. Uh, there seems to be a plant up there, but Lord knows I can't reach that. 
Where are you at? Where are you floating? Oh, there you are. Hi. Oh. 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 It was that easy this whole time. Go figure. Okay. All right. Just yeah. Just absolutely bonk it with a with a yeah, with an apple. And apparently it it gets cross with you about that fact. All right. Now where'd you go? 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 I guess we'll never know. All right. I tried. I spun around in circles and it is gone. Huh, not even being picked up on the radar. Oh, there you are. Well, there's one of them, not the one. Not the one that I just got. Kind of hoping for the other one to show up so I can make that one all luminous and stuff. What are you doing over there? What are you trying to accomplish with all that mess? All right, bye. Uh, what about the other one? Hello? Oh, there you are. I see you're on fire again. That's neat. Oh, oh you're both on fire again. I see, I see. Uh, all right. Oh, what? I definitely hit you with a fruit there. Now you want me to hit you with multiple fruits? That's just aggressive. Uh, oh, okay. I'm trying. God, I'm so bad at aiming. Well, I got rid of the flames. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't really mean anything. Huh. Sure wish I could hit both of you. Okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. These seem like terrible photos. Ugh. Oh. Oh, really? Really? That's the shot that you say is good? You gotta be kidding me with that. All right. And uh, I suppose it's leaving now. Yep. Well, all right then. Two Pokemon is gone. Hopefully you're content with that, I guess. Maybe one of those was at least a two star. Who knows? Who knows? I was definitely just kind of flailing about hoping for the best on that one. Then again, you know, when when is that not what I'm doing? All right. And you just take it, and off we go. Shavu! Shavu, I say. Alright, we've got a lot to discuss. Do we, though? That's the real question. I have my doubts. Also, there we go. There you go, look. They all have their own little, like, extra pose when you go over them. It's really neat. I like that. Anyway, okay, so... Wow, the... Of course, the ones where they're on fire don't count. Why would they? Why would they? Uh, well, these both look like garbage to me, so instead... Let's see. Which of these? Which of these? Yeah, let's go with that one. It seems to be glowing and also is in the middle of the frame. Or at least very close to it. Okay, that's a, that's a solid photo. Don't tell me that it ain't. Nice work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, that was a really good photo. Thank you. Okay, then. And a level up two. What it ulti ultimately means? I do not know. Look at that. You keep on being awesome. Thank you. I appreciate it. A banquet of fire. And a filter. All right, by the by. Now that we've got that Illumina Pokemon, we uh, got something to report. Okie dokie dokie. Okie dokie, Smokey. What you got to say to me now? Other than apparently, you know, go back down to the deep sea and try to find some ruins or something. Sigh. Very much wish that were not the case. All right, what you got? What you got? Well, no, 
another island, another amazing Illumnia Pokemon. That's right, it's just like the travelogue said. Every part of Lentil is home to its own Illumnia Pokemon. Dang, that guy is wide! The question is, how could Captain Vince have found that out? But... Well, maybe he used his eyeballs. He only wrote about meeting two Illumnia Pokemon, right? Yes, and yet he also wrote that there were four. Well, we've seen three. The mysteries just keep piling up. Indeed, that's what makes this so intriguing. All right, all right, all right, all right. Looks like, oh, oh all right, well, 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 what's going on? Hey there, Shutterbugs. Remember how I suggested you try doing a little photography here at camp? Yeah, yeah thanks for the tip. It was cool seeing the camp through fresh eyes. Next. In that case, here's another idea. Why not try starting from a different spot? That ought to give you another new perspective. Oh. A different spot? Like where? Uh, about right here. That's different enough, ain't it? You can take a different route around the camp depending on whether you start here or by the lab. Huh. Well, I'll have to give it a try then. Uh, and by later, I mean right now. Sounds good. Just choose the icon in the upper left of the research camp and let's go! Being more deeply attuned to everything happening right around you will make you a better photographer. Hmm. Anyway, have fun and take all the photos you like. I'll do as I so choose. Thank you. I just so happen to want to do what you told me to. Also, no. That's not what I wanted. Um, Can I change my perspective of the camp? Is, is that an option? Don't overlap. When you have multiple Pokemon in the photo, make sure they're not overlapping and obstructing each other. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, see? Okay. That's different. All right. Uh, no, no. Mm, that's not the right button. Okay, cool. Um, cool. All right, let's back. Go in here. Back it up. Okay. Now, take photos, damn it. There really should be like a toggle or something. I don't know. Anyway, pseudo widow. That's better. Also, that bundle bee isn't underground anymore, so that's nice. Yo, pseudo. Rattata. Rattata and Trubbish, together at last. They're the buddy cop duo of the century. Because they both dwell in the, in, in, the, in, the, in the cities, you dig? I think you do. Anyway, a campfire burns quietly. All right, but what if it burned aggressively? Hmm. All right. Please look over here. Awesome. There you go. Was that so hard? I don't think so. Oh, hello. Hey, you. Look over here. Man, why do you have to be a fake tree about it, man? You could just, you could just look at me. There we go. That's marginally better. Huh. Never thought I'd see a pseudo woodo eat. That's something different. Hey, it's a little something different if there was something. Oh, hello. Hello, various Starly. Nice to see you. Do you want to... You wanna eat? Cause that's probably, you know, a different star thing. Yeah, there you go. Not a high ranking one, but uh, still it's something different. Is that Pikachu going nutso again? Why is that Pikachu always trying to commit crimes? Stop that. Is it just upset that I don't take photos of it? Is that what it's going on about? No way. Hey, you. Oh. See, there's something in the grass. Oh, and then I just knocked that noise right off that thing. Let's go. Den -den -den -den. All right, well, could have been cooler, could have been cooler. I'm not gonna lie, I thought that was dookie. Uh, glad to say that it's not. And bonked you. Bonked you again. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? How's it hang? Oh, hey, there's that odd Dino. Huh. Hey, over here. Over here, you ding dong. Yeah, there you go. Come on, look at me. Look over here. Look over here, dang it. This isn't so hard to understand. Uh, I swear, so many of these Pokemon, just they just refuse to be agreeable. Oh, well, that's adorable. Thank you for the little jaunty jig you did there. Not while I was playing the song, mind you. Just in general, I guess. Alright. Hello. How's it going? 
I'm glad that I finally got a photo of your face that was really clear. Okay, that'll have to do. That'll have to do indeed. Yeah. I got one mid-leap. Maybe that's something. Who's to say? Who's to say? All right. Ta-da. Yeah, there's probably at least like two or three good photos in all of those somewhere. We're all collectively hoping. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Pseudo Wudo. He's the pseudo weest Wudo you've ever done seen. I wish one of those were too sh. Ah. Gonna have to do that again on my own time or something. Alright, fine, that'll do. Uh, what about leaping? Is that not a photo of value? I guess not. Well, ain't that a bummer. Alright then, we'll settle for that. Ratata! And Starly. Ooh, double! Ah, right, because I fed it. I remember that now. Let's see. I believe it was also a dancy lass at one point. Yes, it certainly was. That will do nicely. And that one's angry because I threw something at his head. And that one is in the no talk me, I angie pose. And you know what? It's allowed to do so. It. I interrupted its nap. And that's one of the worst, most heinous crimes I can imagine. It really is. Oh, nice, gold. All right, cool, 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 cool. Take in all that. Now, it may not be facing, but come on. That's a decent bundle be right there. Okay. I would have been cross with you otherwise. And what say thee to this Rattata, Silver? If it were just a little bit closer, perhaps. Yeah, photos is photos. You really do be I angie. <laughs> uh, I kind of, I kind of love the photo explicitly for that fact. Yeah, ready? Come on now, come on now. Just keep slapping things around. What about this Audino though? You can't say this is a bad Audino photo. Yeah. There we go. Thank you. And yeah, you uh. You ain't ever gonna get a research level two around these here parts. Alrighty, alrighty. So, uh, alright, so I'm guessing needs photos. Uh, yeah, alright, you want me to find the ruins underwater is what you want. Okay, well, I'll go do that then. Uh, 